Welcome everybody, I'm RJ of the Nerdy Brew and here on this channel we talk TV, movies, and everything in between all while drinking a cup of coffee. Now if you like one of those things or all of those things, why don't you consider like, subscribing, and hit that notification bell and becoming a fellow Brewster. So today fellow Brewsters, this is a coffee talk on black men and mental health. So I wanna talk about Montrose from the show of Lovecraft Country. Um, Montrose was played by the late, great Michael K. Williams. And he's an analog for multiple aspects of the struggle as a black man for certain aspects that I can't relate to. But him as an example covers multiple standpoints and paradigm. Matros Freeman's character in Lovecraft Country is depicted as a victim of generational trauma. And he has passed that trauma down to his son Atticus, a tick played by Jonathan Majors. Shit. <laughs> I, I spent so much time sitting in that chair. From another one of your ass whoopers watching up. George, work on the guy wishing he was my father and now you. And throughout the show, Montrose is troubled with the relationship with his son and it is explored. Um, and it becomes clear that he's has a difficult time expressing his emotions and connecting with Atticus and due to his own traumatic experiences. Matros grew up in a time and a place where racism and violence against black people were rampant and his experience have left deep scars on him that he struggles to overcome. His attempts to protect his son from the same trauma that he experienced may have contributed to his emotional distance from Atticus and his struggles with alcoholism. However, the show progresses. Matros begins to open up to Atticus and confront his own trauma, leading to some powerful and emotional moments between a father and a son. So Matros is depicted as struggling with his sexuality. I can't relate to that, but that's a, lot, that's a problem for a lot of men in the community. He is portrayed as a closeted gay man and he's been forced to hide his true, his true self due to societal expectations and the fear of violence and persecution. Matro's struggles with his own sexuality is a significant part of the character's art. Wait, I'm sorry. As the show progresses, Matros begins to confront his own feelings and desires, leading to some powerful and emotional moments of self-discovery and acceptance. Uh, Michael K. Williams have received critical acclaim for his portrayal as Matros, the complexity of his journey, um, self-discovery, and his nuanced performance help to bring depth and humanity to the character in an often marginalized and overlooked group inside mainstream. More uh, more recently, it started coming out to not be as stigmatized. Um, what, what is that show? P-Valley um, highlights on, uh, on black homosexuality. Um, what's another show? There's a few of them out there in this world. The the thought of these black stories are getting told from those aspects that were not just monolith. And there's a whole lot of human struggles that we all go through. Despite these challenges, there is hope. By bringing awareness about the issues, advocating for greater resources and support, um, and working to dismantle these systems of oppression that perpetuate them. Um, we can create a more just and equitable society. If you know someone who's struggling with mental health issues, it's important for them um, the encouragement to seek out help, um, support, and treatment. 
whether that means talking to a therapist, a good friend, um, a support group, connecting with other resources within our communities. Um, there is help available. That's why this uh, video is brought to you by BetterHelp.com. I'm kidding. I'm joking. I don't have any sponsors yet. Um, but this would be a great place to insert that here. Um, please help me with watch time. Um, anywho, we can work to ensure that black men and other marginalized groups receive the care and the support that they need uh, to lead to happy and healthy lives. So I just wanted to bring that up. Uh, yes, I've been dealing with my own mental health. And I wanted to kind of bring that to the forefront, but I also wanted to keep that within the niche of the channel that it's not just, it's not just like an ancillary thing that, or an arbitrary thing that just happens with one individual. Like, now it's getting brought out and we need to keep continuing to have the conversation. And with that being said, I'm gonna bring this video to an end. I hope this video was able to help you. And um, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Um, it really will help out because um, I'm not trying to just have a channel. I'm trying to grow the community as well. And um, I'm going to bring this video to an end. And I want you to be you, do you see the bigger picture. Have a fantastic day because you deserve it. This is that channel. Peace. On top, on top, come through, Bruce Lee chop, yeah. more rocks, no red socks, tryna go far like boondocks, headshot, blunt stay high, talkin' shit, gotta pull up on they block, you fraud, I'm couch guard, nigga got a tax like a state charge, safe house, safe house, safe house, safe house, safe house.